Jillian and I first got together at sharing a studio a couple of years ago and realised that we had a lot of interests in common in terms of the kind of work we're interested in and the ideas that we explore. So we were interested in doing some work about stains and exploring the marks of time and how history can be shown through artwork. And that turned into a discussion about DNA and genetics and how that could kind of all fit together into a really interesting project. So we put together a proposal and a funding application to the Arts Council to see if we could spend some time actually in the labs and working with scientists to explore those ideas in more detail. I think one of the things that's been really interesting about the project is seeing the similarities in the way scientists work and the way they conduct research to the way that we work as artists. I think artists tend to keep things very open-ended and loose and work with lots of possibilities. Scientists work with the same what-ifs and looking for answers to questions, but there's a different rigour, there's a different nature to their research. It's about exploring and investigating, taking risks, trying things and discovering new things that you didn't even intend to work on and finding new discoveries. And I think that really fed into the way that Ruth and I worked. There was a lot of discussion of, on ideas, of planning what we were going to do next based on some experimentation that we'd done before. And um, we became more analytical. I think our focus was more directed than, than perhaps would have been if we'd been in our art studio. For us, the work is about the exploration of ideas and expressing the kind of information that's come through with DNA and genetics. So we're looking at things like repetition and mutation and how we can show that through creating artwork. Being in the scientific environment is a bit like being a child in an adult's world. Everything looks different, everything looks interesting, you're trying to make sense of everything. It's things that you know but altered for specific purposes. What we're really interested in is people's different interpretations and understanding because we haven't got one fixed viewpoint about what our work means. It will mean different things to different people. And for me, all of those interpretations are valid and really, really fascinating to see how different people respond and react and take different things from the work we've made. Every piece of work I think that Ruth and I have started has surprised us and I think when we surprise ourselves we know we're in the right area and that's, that's when we get really excited. <laughs>